Hey, what's up guys? This is YGroups123, and today we're going to be learning how to make a super macro lens. It doesn't work on my eyesight, but both my cameras are broken. Uh, I tried it with my friend's camera at work. Uh, sorry I didn't get any footy with it. Uh, so this is what you're going to need. You're going to need a binocular with one of those like blue color binoculars like that. Blue tinted binoculars. And you're just going to want to get that big lens out of it. Uh, it doesn't need to be a tinted lens, actually. It's just if you want it for, like, other colors. As you can see. It's kind of like a mirror also. Like a see-through mirror. But it's only for really close-up shots. See? It gets very... Or it's a zoom-in. It's a macro lens. Or telescopic, kind of, because it zooms in. But it's also kind of a mirror. Uh, so what you're going to want to do is just take that out. Then there's a little rubber thing. This that protects it. And if you want to use that, you can if you're just going to screw it on. But you can make it. Oh, wait. It might not work. Uh, I'm almost sure this will work if you do it right. It's just gonna want, to, uh, and you're gonna need like I think there's a PVC adapter. I don't know what it is. Uh uh. Um, uh, and you're just gonna want to put it on. Oh, whoa, dropped. Uh, put it on that. Sorry about that. Uh, I what I was saying now. Oh yeah, you're gonna need a PVC adapter. Or, if you don't have one of those laying around, you can use a, a toilet paper roll and some tape, duct tape, anything works. Just gonna have to tape it in so it'll have a nice snug fit, unless it's perfectly sized. But mine is not. I don't have, I don't feel like taping it right now, so. Wait, it might be. But then you can cut it down like to about there, right there, then, or there, sorry, my camera's backwards. Uh, so then you can just look through it and you'll see amazing results. It's super clear, it's like an autofocus, or it's like a focused camera. It's super clear right there. But then kind of blurry in the background. Sorry, but you can't really focus into the background too much. Uh, and actually, this is pretty good size. It's not coming out if I shake it or anything. Uh, I It doesn't fit my camera, but then if you use a PVC adapter, it fits my camera. And if you, you have a PVC adapter, that actually works a lot better unless you want super close-up shots. If you want super close-up shots, use the toilet paper. Uh, you'll still need the rubber thing for the PVC adapter. You're just gonna kind of shove it in there, so you can just push it in there, and it should pop right in like that. Then, sorry, as I said before, my camera on this is not focused. Right there, it's really not clear. And, if you seen my other video, this does fit into the lens head. Uh, fits perfectly, actually. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. See ya.